Hey everyone and welcome to this Iceland shopping haul video. So we've just got our delivery turn up from Iceland and uh, we're going to be showing you what we got in the order. So uh, if you enjoy watching please click like, comment, share and subscribe to my channel. That would be awesome. Sorry if I don't sound as raw and loud as normal but I have a horrible migraine headache. So there we go. Anyway... Let's do this. Right, so first of all, we have two giant Yorkshire puddings. I mean, these are, <laughs> these are giant. <laughs> Look at them, like, next to my hand. They are massive. And there's two of them. So, you know, what's better than one giant Yorkshire pudding? Two of them. Next up, we've got the old favourite. Well, not my favourite, obviously, Nathan's favourite because I'm a vegetarian. These are the Greg's Sausage Rolls, a four-pack, which are exclusive to Iceland. <laughs> then, <laughs> my favourites, uh, these are also from the Greg's range. These are the Vegan Steak Bakes, and I love them. How many packs did you get? Oh, I knew you'd do this. How many packs? One pack. That doesn't look like one pack there. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four. Four packs. Yeah, but it's because we don't get an Iceland audit every day or every week. We get it every, like, what, fortnight? Yeah. So that's These, like two weeks. Exactly. It's better to buy in bulk. <laughs> or I could just eat them all in one. Honestly, if you've not tried these, they are just amazing they're so nice and um, by the way i'm not a vegan i am a vegetarian but obviously i do eat um vegan and um vegetarian food but that honestly they're amazing right this is something new and it's not vegan it's no i'm not eating it because it's not vegetarian however i do have the richmond meat free sausages yes, you do. and they are really nice you like them. i do so this is something new that nathan saw on the website and uh, he thought he would give it a go and it says it's made with the nation's favourite sausage. <laughs> Sorry. Is it your favourite sausage? Sorry, I'm not... It, which, hurts. Which your sausage? it hurts when I laugh, but that just... I don't know why it made me laugh. Favourite sausage. Anyway, like, it's just like the thought of a group of people going, what's your favourite sausage? And what is your favourite sausage? Well, Richmond meat free. Yeah. Anyways... This is, I've got to say that blooming S word again, the sausage hot pot. Family sausage. I mean, this looks actually really nice. They should do this with a vegetarian Richmond sausage. But yeah, it's nice, isn't it? It does look nice. Our own Irish recipe. Oh, they're Irish sausages. Do you know that? Yes. You didn't. Did, did you? Yeah. I didn't know that. Oh, well. But yeah, it looks nice though, doesn't it? So what's in a hot pot? Like potatoes, veg. Veg and gravy. Obviously sausage and veg and gravy. It's a, it's a hot pot. You could kind of make your own as well. I could make my own with the vegetarian lots sausages. People, lots of people do make their own. No. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Got that. I didn't know people could make hot pot. I don't know what hot pot well, is. How did Richmond make hot pot? Yeah, well you can't make your own sandwiches. No. Well then, <laughs> it's all about sandwiches. We've got two bags. Two whole bags. <clears throat> Bernard Matthews cheesy sandwiches with a new cheesier recipe. And there's something I like, and that's cheese. Everybody loves a bit of cheese. Right. Oh, I forgot these. Oh, look at these. Now, I'm going to be honest, before he drops me in it and embarrasses me, I'll get it out there. These are Ison's own steak cut chips and so when i saw these when we were doing the unpacking i thought these were steak flavored chips <laughs> so embarrassing what am i such a weirdo but they're they're not the steak house no but it's because yeah. you can get flavored chips yeah. and you have them salt and pepper chips so yeah. i assume these were steak flavored chips yeah. but they're not they're not so why are they called steak cut explain well, it the cut of them they're not small little no, I don't. Un I still don't get it. They don't look like a chunk of steak. No, but they're a chunk of tater. Oh, okay. So we'll, anyway, they're big old chips. Look, they are massive, um, but they're not as big as a big lump of steak. 
Yeah, but you wouldn't have a chip that's the size of a steak. <laughs> Could you that's imagine it? Potato. That'd be nice. <laughs> you could have like a giant Yorkshire pudding and a giant chip the sh shape of a steak, you know? I'm letting my imagination yeah, that's just a potato. <laughs> yeah. Oh my. Okay, what have we got? Are these different? Yeah, I've okay. Got one of each. So what what are these? You've got the bird's eye steam fresh. Family favourite mix. So these are nice and good. So healthy. Broccoli. Sweet and corn. And carrot. What's your favourite out of them? The carrot. Yeah? Yeah. Do you know what mine is? The broccoli. Correct. <laughs> that was a couple's challenge. Yeah. <laughs> then we've got hold on. Oh, it's the same lot, it's just yeah. different. Yeah, this Veg. one's the Super Sunshine Mix. Super Sunshine. Oh, yeah, Super Sunshine Mix. And what's that one? The Family Favourite. Family Favourite. So what's this got? Oh, no. Carrot, peas, and sweet oh. corn. I have got a phobia of peas, so I'm not going to look at that bag for too long. Okay, Enjoy we'll eating them. Just get them, get them away, away, yeah? Oh, the Tiger Loaf is back. The old faithful. The, yeah. Uh, the medium, medium size bloomer. Good old bloomers. Do you know what bloomers are? Are you too young? Underwear. Yeah, knickers. Yes. Yeah. Well, I don't know. You're young. I'm old. There we go. Look at that. I love the design on a tiger loaf. Anyway, so we've got the bread. We've got some uh, sliced brioche rolls. If you've not tried a brioche roll, you really should. They're very soft but very sweet. And you could either have them with something sweet, or you could have something savoury. I'm having burgers with mine. Oh yeah, you put your burgers in them. Oh, that's what I need to get. You need to get the vegetarian My vegetarian bur burgers, yeah. Anyway, these are not just normal brioche, they're luxury ones. Because I am luxury. Now these are for me. <laughs> oh, gonna drop them. These are British jacket potatoes. And if I turn the bag, I didn't see how many there are. Oh, look at them. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love a potato. I've had a potato every day of my life. <laughs> really? Well, not every, most days. A lot of the days, well, not every day. But... No, I'd say 80% yeah, of not every... every day. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so I love the, a potato. The ingredients in this bag, just in case you wondered, is... Potatoes. Potato, 100%. It actually yeah. says that. Where does it say that? Does it where? Ingredients, potatoes, oh, yeah. 100% um, was, well, was in the bag. Gold. Just in case anybody was confused. Wasn't sure, yeah. Anna, this is my bread. This is my favourite. Medium sliced whole milk. I added sugar from Warburton's and it's very high in fibre. And did you know, only 55 calories a slice. That's good, isn't it? That is good. So if I have the whole pack, I won't feel too guilty. No. <laughs> All in one. <laughs> I you. won't do that. But it's nice. So I've gone for the Elm Spring. Now normally I get the big old bottles. But what happens is I just leave them around and anyway, so I thought what I'll do instead is just get the small bottle. It's really boring. This is boring conversation, but necessary. <laughs> Someone at the, the door. Doorbell. Who's at the doorbell? Um, so yeah, I've just got this, this pack of six waters. Maybe it's someone from Iceland. Maybe they've like left something. Okay, next up, it is time for me to celebrate and uh, I am going to celebrate with these bad boys. These are... Amazing. Primula cheese spread, the original flavour. Um, it does say on here, love to share, but I don't love to share. And I won't share. They're mine. Um, <laughs> it's a long story, so I'm not going to bore you with it. But basically, I've had Primula for years. And I think it was last year, they had some issues. Or the year before, I can't remember when it was. But they had last some issues, year, yeah. yeah. Well, no, actually, it was the year before, I think, before lockdown. Was it? Oh, it was before lockdown, yeah. It's like, God, it's been that long that I haven't had Primula. Yeah. Anyway, they had a few problems with, well, I won't go into it, <laughs> but there was problems at the factory and so they took off the shelves and people couldn't buy them and unless you saw them at some dodgy corner shop and I still didn't buy them. Anyway, but now they're back on proper supermarket, you know, fridges and that. Anyway, they're back. I've got it. Yeah, I can't it. wait. I just, I yeah, just yeah. need it. I need this Primula in my life because yeah, it's amazing. And if anyone doesn't like Primula... I don't. How can you not like Primula? Because it's me. Oh, it's amazing. Right, so we've got one, two, three of these chicken and bacon pastas. So, um, hold on, that one's not very clear. What have we got in here? Chicken and bacon. No, <laughs> see what else it says. <laughs> God, it's not clear. 
Can't read it. Combined. No, what does it say? It says cooked. Oh, cooked cook, pasta. Cooked pasta with cooked diced chicken breast with added water and diced cooked smoked bacon with added water in a mayonnaise dress. There we go. That's nice and clear. So that's what it is, basically. I did look at getting the cheese one for me, but it didn't look very appealing, so I didn't get it. We got this. Oh, this this describes me. Hot and spicy. No. Or chicken. Too hot and spicy. Or chicken. I mean, look at me right now in my pajamas. I am too hot and too spicy. I'm not. Um, chicken and breadcrumbs. So these are yeah, hot and spicy. Are these new? Well, you've not had them no, before. I've not had them before. Have you? Yeah. But from Sainsbury's, not Adam from my oh, okay. So they, these are nice. those. We've got some ham. Ham. <laughs> it's not very good me being a Jew holding a pack of ham. ham. But they're not for me, so what do I care? But yeah, what, what can we say? This is wafer thin cooked ham for you. What can you say? It's ham. <laughs> <Scared>. <laughs> oh, sorry. So we've got the usual. Ah, these, oh, these looks great. These looks great. That's not good grammar. No. Fully loaded, triple pepperoni pizza fries. Yeah, they're all delicious, them ones. Oh, I love it when you have them, because I sniff it, and mm. it's just a really nice smell. So what is it? Layered with tomato sauce, triple pepperoni, and mozzarella cheese. Honestly, these smell nice, and obviously they taste nice to him. And then, I've got something new this week. Here's that hot dog loaded oh, fries. Oh, that looks so nice. So not fair. Why am I vegetarian? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fully loaded, hot dog loaded fries. New... So what have you got here then? You've got layered with tomato, ketchup and mustard and sauce and mozzarella. So it's hot dog. It's literally, yeah. Chip, <sighs> mozzarella, so ketchup, good. mustard. Oh, it's nice. I suppose I could do something similar. I have got vegetarian hot, hot dogs. dogs. You can just chop them up. Yeah, them the um, Tavao. They're yeah. really nice. If you're looking for a nice vegetarian or vegan hot dog, check out the Tavao ones. Uh, I don't work for Tavao. <laughs> just that I like, I just like them. Yeah, send me some sausage. Um, next up we got this, what is this? Bird's eye four short crust chicken pies. A chicken pie? Chicken pie. I don't ever think I've seen you eat a chicken pie. Oh, a chicken have you pie. had chicken Oh no, you have, you have. I remember now. Yeah. yeah, sorry, I just went a bit blank there. Chicken pie. I never liked chicken pies when I had meat. No. Nah. Never liked a chicken pie. Well, they said they never liked <laughs> you either. You weren't their favourite. <laughs> I, no, I used to like a nice steak pie. Yeah, I'd never eat the steak and K. I can't say the nah. word because it makes me uncomfortable. But I used to just have I don't a steak. Like nah, just oh. Anyway, but if you like a chicken pie, what have we got next? The pizza pockets, the usual. Ah, uh, see, I like it when you have these as well because they smell nice. I'll just go around sniffing all your food. Yeah, that's pretty much all you do is sniff my food. <laughs> you don't need to eat me. Nah. pizza pockets, pepperoni. Yeah, you literally put them in the microwave a couple of minutes. Boom, they 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 are nice. Move them out of the way. What else have we got? Oh, toad in the hole. Toad in the hole. The sausage is back. To anyone in uh, not in the UK, if you don't know what a toad in the hole is, I mean you can probably tell. It's from not the... really a toad. Yeah, I think a lot of non-UK people think it is an actual a toad. Because in France they eat frogs' legs. Yeah, but we don't. Nah, I thought we Why would you eat a frog? Well, that's just wrong. <laughs> I get really offended because I like frogs yeah, I, I could even understand eating a frog but the legs no. are really skinny but why would you eat their gonna, legs no, but if you're going to eat any bit of a frog the belly you'd eat the bit that's not like, and that it, does, I wonder if when they're on a plate do they look like a couple of feet go, ribbit oh. ribbit anyway so it's not a toad it is just three well not just necessarily but in this that's one four. I was four in there oh so there. there's four sausages in a Yorkshire pudding I mean, you could even do your own Yorkshire pudding. You could get your uh, um, toad in the hole. You could get your own Yorkshire pudding and put sausages in. Yeah. <laughs> People make their own toad in the hole. Because you can make... Look, a hot own. pot. What's this? This is no. Yeah. What's this here? Boneless chicken thigh. Why do you always get something where I have to say thigh or breast? Because it's fun. <laughs> it's not. It's embarrassing. These are XL... Boneless chicken pie burgers, hot and spicy, like a zinger burger. Yeah, oh, from uh, KFC, KFC, yeah. Mm. But They're new. No. Yeah. And I'm going to eat. That's what the British rolls are for. Oh, so you can... Oh, you don't get it with the roll like that. No. You just get the meat bit this and then you the put burger. it in your own burger. Yeah. Oh, I see. Nice. And then we've got the usual. Hey, the Capri Suns. Look at all these. Lovely. I'll have a couple of them. Millions. Great taste, water, fruit, juice, without anything artificial. Yeah, I really, I really like Capri Suns. Yeah, I know. These That's are my favourite flavour. 
I might disappear. Anyway, <laughs> so what is your favourite thing out so of the whole? Yeah. The Richmond hot pot, which is all yeah. over there. Yeah. On the yeah. You know what I am. And then the hot dog fries. That's my second. Yeah, that looks nice. That's mine. Yours is the primula. I just want to just, just eat squeeze it. The I, I know. I literally it. would. I have done that before, and it's made me a bit sick. Yeah. But it's nice. Anyway, listen, that's the end of the video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, now we've got the boring job of putting it all away. So, you know. Anyway, uh, please check out Minxlaw123 ASMR, my other channel. Links down below. All the links to my social media are down below as well. Blah, check blah, it blah. Out. Check it out. Check, check, and check uh, it out. TikTok. And your other well. channel, because your other channel is awesome. Uh, oh, ASMR. what do you think? Do you yeah. watch my videos? Secretly. No, you don't. No, I don't. I secretly don't watch <laughs> You it. secretly don't watch me yeah. whispering and tapping on stuff. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you to Iceland. Not that they give it to us for no, free. No. We've had to pay for it, but thank if you. They for... ever want to yeah, if you want to sponsor us, feel free, Iceland. To be fair, though, um, my favourite two supermarkets now are Sainsbury's and Iceland. We didn't really go to Iceland before, but now with the delivery, because of the obvious going on, and you've had to start getting all the online deliveries, Iceland are really good service. Yeah. Very good they turn up on time, they're, you know, good service, the price is good, you can get some random things. Anyway, I'm rambling. Listen, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye from me, bye from this man here. And bye from the spuds and <laughs> the, the primula. See you later, everyone. <laughs>